what does it mean? So we're going to talk about Regulus. What does it mean? I get a lot of questions about, like, what does it mean? Um, So let's get started. What does it mean if you were born with your son conjuncting Regulus? So that energy means your son, which is how you shine in the world, is attracted to Regulus kind of energy. And Regulus is what? It's about fame. It's about royalty. It's the bright star in the sky. And your chart is saying, oh, I love that shininess, the brightness of it all. Maybe this lifetime you're going to be drawn to shiny things. It could be in the entertainment industry. It could be around lighting. It could be around famous people. It could be around luxury. It could be around Hollywood, New York, Las Vegas, Tokyo, Japan, Paris, you name it, worldwide, nationwide. If you are interested and drawn to fame or the entertainment industry, acting, screenwriting, going to school, to be an an artistic person, and you have your son conjunct Regulus, I would say it's a very positive aspect and is a great way to use that energy. If you have Regulus conjuncting the moon and it's a tight orb, again, I work with three-degree orbs. I don't work really with big orbs. Sometimes I do. But the smaller the orb degree, the better. So let's say you have Regulus conjuncting your moon. You could dream of fame. You could dream of working with royalty and the entertainment industry and the spotlight. You could be pursuing acting. You could be drawn to certain actors or performers of the movie industry or film. Anything to do with Regulus you could be drawn to if your moon is conjuncting Regulus. Now, what if you have Regulus conjuncting your north node? Regulus conjuncting the north node could mean you have luck in that area. Luck in a Regulus way. Luck with the lighting. Luck with famous people. Luck in the spotlight. If you ha- And it's karmic. could be very karmic. It could be the direction you are supposed to be heading this lifetime. Because remember, the north node is the direction we are supposed to be heading in. And so if you have Regulus hanging out with your north node, Regulus is flavoring that north node and going, okay, let's go that way. Now, Regulus conjuncting your south node, another karmic connection. South node Regulus could mean you already know about the spotlight and the entertainment industry and how to shine. You may have learned how to perform in your early years. And even if you didn't learn how to perform, you could have been very comfortable in the spotlight or comfortable with attention. You could be one of those kids that's in school who's in drama or acting or the class president. Remember, Regulus is shiny. It's about attention on some level. It's like a bright, bright spotlight on you. And so when you are looking at your Regulus conjuncting your sun or your moon or Mercury or Venus or Mars, or if it's on your ascendant or your descendant, or if it's on your midheaven, your career marker or your IC, you bring that energy in to the mix and blend it. And that is what your end result will be. You're going to have probably a lot of ways that you use this energy because your chart's with you your entire life. So I'm going to end there. And I hope that answered some questions for those of you who have them about Regulus conjunctions. I'll talk to you soon.